but she can come back. Uh, take off your panties. I put this bitch in the back of the club, and I know what I'm saying. I'm spitting like that. Yo. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Q. We're back again with another episode of Cute Timber. If you guys are already subscribed, welcome back. But if you're new here and you're not subscribed and you don't know what Cute Timber is, basically it's a 30 day challenge I started where I'm uploading every day in the month of September. If you want to make sure you never miss an episode, go down and hit the subscribe button, and right next to that is going to be a bell button. And if you hit that, you're never going to miss an episode. Yeah, make sure you do that. But anyways, in today's video, a bunch of you guys have been asking me to do like a vocal tutorial and just a beat tutorial for Slump Six and Baby Santana, Antisocial, like something like that. I might not be saying Slump's name right. I'm not really, I'm honestly not sure how you even say it but it's a pretty cool like sub genre i would say of rage and i think slump's about to drop a project too so this should be a good video but yeah basically here's a little preview of the sound that we're going to be going for today yeah so let's just jump in fl studio and start something from scratch but before we get started i just want to announce that i am going to be using serum and i'm going to be using my brand new bank that is going to be available the first of the month on october it's called cyber here's a little preview of what it's going to look like But basically it's gonna be 50 serum presets it's gonna be a midi kit a loop kit and of course a one-shot kit which is just all the serum presets and you can grab that all as a bundle or you can buy them all separately if you want to but anyways i'm just going to be using this video as a nice preview so you guys can get an idea of what the sounds are going to be like and make sure you guys stay tuned if you want to sign up for the pre-sale because that should be opening very soon all right so first thing i'm gonna do is just turn the bpm up to like 146 and then we're gonna go to replace and we're gonna open up serum and here is my kit right here cyber and i'm just gonna go into the synth section and I think I'm going to use this one called Let It Bang, and we're just going to go into the piano roll. I'm going to set the scale highlighting to, let's do B, let's do B minor. And I'm just going to start by building some bass notes. Turn the metronome on. Yep, and I'm just gonna duplicate that over and then we're gonna bring it up an octave and we're just gonna put some chords on top. So I ended up switching the synth to this one called Rockstar. We're just gonna duplicate that over. And then what we're gonna do is I routed this to mixture track one. And I'm going to see what it sounds like with halftime on it. I don't know if I'm going to keep it, but let's just test it out. And now we're not going to do that. But what I am going to do is add an EQ. We're going to take out a lot of that high end. I'm just going to lengthen this last part of the chord. And then next, we're just going to try and find a lead. Honestly, this is probably going to turn out to be like two, maybe three sounds. All right, so I got this lead called Cryptic, and we're just going to kind of build something on top here. And then I'm going to go into the chord sound that we have. I'm going to solo it out and we're going to go to the effects tab and just add some distortion. Perfect. And now we're going to go back into Serum. And of course, we're going into my bank cyber. And now I'm going to start in the plucks.
All right, so I like this. I'm going to route it to a mix track. And I'm going to take this first EQ, and I'm just going to use it as kind of like a gain. And then what we're going to do is just add Valhalla Vintage Verb. Turn the decay down a bit and the mix down a bunch. And then I'm going to add just a Fruity Delay. Fruity Delay 3, and we're going to right-click the time and set it to 1 8th. Ping pong it. That's perfect. So I'm going to take all the melodic parts right now and right click this button down here and click route to this track only. Just so any effect I put on this track applies to everything. And what we're going to do is add an EQ and pull out all that low end. And then I'm also going to add an RC retro color. Perfect. And last thing we're going to add here is just another serum. And we're going back into my bank and we're going to grab a bass. Yep, and we're going to use this one called Combat. Then just duplicate that over. So we have this track right here where I can put effects on all the melodic parts. And we're going to go and add halftime and see if this sounds cool. And that's perfect right there. So we're going to split this up and just arrange it a bit. So duplicate this over a bunch. And we're going to do an 8-bar intro. And what I'm going to do here, go back to this track. And I'm going to go to the halftime and move this mix knob around. And then if you go to Tools, Last Tweaked, create an automation clip with that. And we're just going to have the intro something like this. And then we're going to loop this part right here. And we're going to drag a, another pattern into the playlist. Make it 8 bars. You guys already know that I'm going to be using my drum kit, which is available at quintababa.com. You can either grab Full Circle, which is a multi-kit, or you can grab Euphoria, which is, the, which is the drum kit that it actually is. So first thing I'm going to add is the 808. I feel like starting with the 808 this time. And of course, since we're going for that anti-social sound, we're doing two 808s. So I'm going to grab this one right here, and then also Death Race. And first thing we're going to do is pull that kick out of Death Race. And then we're going to adjust the attack, the hold, and the release. Make it look like this. Turn that up as well. And make sure we put cut itself on both. And we're going to go into the 808 here. I'm just going to pull the out knob up. And we're going to adjust the ADR like this. And hit Control L on my keyboard. And the next 808 should start there. And then we're going to go to Death Race. I'm bringing this up in octave. And then we're going to duplicate that over for eight and this one over as well. We're going to grab a snare. I've been liking this one for my kit. And then we're going to go to the clap folder and apply the default pattern. And this up a bit and bring it down a few semitones. Then we'll grab a hi hat. And we're just going to fill each two steps, and then we're just going to do that yeet bounce, which is just pretty much like this. And that's perfect right there. And literally... Nice thing about these hi hat patterns is you can just repeat this over. And right, I'm just gonna add some extra snares. Yep, 
Yep, that works. And last but not least, an open net. That's perfect right there. So we're going to split this by channel and drag it out. And I'm just duplicating these drums over twice. And I'm going to pull the hi-hat out right here. And then like everything out here for a second. And we're bringing all the drums back in except for the open hat. And then the bass comes in right here. And then I'm just going to cut this off right here. We're going to have the gross beat come back up here again. And that's about a minute long. So we just duplicate that over twice. And that's the whole beat right there. You guys already know what time it is. Let's do a little freestyle. All right, so I'm going to be using one of my vocal presets. So if you guys want to use the one that I'm using in this video, go to quintababa.com and you go to this button right here, vocal templates. And I'm actually going to be using the autumn vocal template just because I feel like it kind of fits that style right now. But if you guys stay tuned for the next video or should be soon to come, I am going to do a remake of Antisocial. So you could also just wait for that too. But this is going to be the preset I'm using right now. So let's get this freestyle. <laughs> Smith and Watson, yeah. What the fuck you wanna talk? I'ma go and spit back. Everything I say is facts. You don't wanna know that, ha? Huh? Whoa, yeah. Whoa, ha? Whoa, yeah. Ha, huh? ha. Whoa, yeah. Ha. Huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Whoa, yeah. Whoa, ha. Huh? Yeah. What? What? Back to the chair. Back to the chair. All right, guys, so that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed this one. I think this turned out pretty cool. This beat was actually really fun to make. If you guys did enjoy it or if you enjoyed any part of this at all, you guys can do me a favor and hit that like button. But yeah, you guys already know the deal. If you're not in the Discord already, make sure you join that. If you want to cop any of the sounds you heard or any of the vocal presets, you already know where to go, quintababa.com. As for right now, that's all I got for you guys. I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Doses.